Well, there doesn't seem to be any fuel filter. We're gonna start down here, taking off, this is the air cleaner house. Couple of five sixteenths right here. Okay, we got that one out and our entire housing comes off and away. Shut the fuel off, just like that. Next, we're gonna remove the fuel line. I've got a pan on the floor to catch any fuel on those squishy guys. I'll move him and hold that guy off of there. Probably gonna have a bit of fuel. So I'm gonna cut the line. Here, I'll shorten it about yay much. Get rid of that one. And we'll use some of these clamps that came with the kit. See if we can't put that on there. Doesn't seem to indicate a flow direction, but it just looks like there's a mesh screen inside. Nothing spectacular. Filt filters in place, slide the hose onto the uh, fuel inlet, and we'll get ready to make the choke. Get around and get these both started. Well, fuel filter is causing some interference here. I don't think this part is important, so we'll Gonna trim the make room for our fuel filter so it doesn't seem to entangle with anything. Took the die grinder and trimmed the plastic on the intake here a bit. And uh, I'm hopeful that wasn't important. And when you are all done, there you got a nice little fuel filter tucked away, hoping to prevent future damage to the carburetor uh, that I just replaced. We'll be putting that video out sometime here, I hope. Anyways, thanks for watching.